Example 5.5. Figure shows a small magnetized needle P placed at a point O. The arrow shows the direction of its magnetic moment. The other arrow shows different positions and orientations of the magnetic moment of another identical magnetized needle Q. A. In which configuration the system is not in equilibrium? B. In which configuration is the system in? 1. Stable and 2. Unstable equilibrium. C. Which configuration correspond to the lowest potential energy among all the configurations sold? See here one dipole that is P. Another dipole Q is placed at six different positions Q1, Q2, Q3, Q4, Q5 and Q6. Now for this particular arrangement we have to give these answers. Clear the question? Now here we can say this thing the dipole Q or we can say magnetized needle Q is placed at different positions in the magnetic field of magnetized needle P. Now magnetic field of magnetized needle P that we can write as on the axis mu 0 upon 4 pi 2 mp upon r cube. So this field will be in the direction of magnetic moment of P. B equatorial that is minus mu 0 upon 4 pi mp upon r cube. This negative sign represent this thing, the field at any point on the equator that is in the opposite direction of magnetic moment. Clear to all of you? Now see the figure. The magnetized needle P that is placed at O and dipole moment that is represented in upward direction here. Okay. Now see here PQ1 this one and PQ2 are not in equilibrium because the magnetic field on the equatorial line this is the equatorial line for P so, magnetic field of P at any point in the equatorial plane that is vertically downward. Jo equation pramane in the opposite direction of MP. So, magnetic moment that is this direction. So, on the equatorial line it is downward. So, here the magnetized needle Q and the magnetic field of P both are perpendicular for the position Q1 and Q2 and therefore we can say these two positions are not in equilibrium. Clear this thing? For most stable equilibrium, the dipole moment that should be in the direction of the magnetic field and for most unstable position the dipole moment and magnetic field should be in opposite direction. Now see think about Q3. So when the magnetic needle Q that is in the position Q3 so, it is on the equator of the P. So, magnetic field of P that is also vertically downward. Q3 that is also downward. It implies that 
the angle between the magnetic field of p and magnetic moment of q that is zero therefore we can say it is most stable position clear this one now magnetic field of p on its axis that is in the direction of the magnetic moment and magnetic needle q that is placed on the axis but in the opposite direction of the magnetic field of p so theta that is pi in this case so we can say this particular position that is most unstable clear to all of you then after magnetic needle q is placed in position q5 and here for magnetic needle q the magnetic moment that is upward but it is on the equatorial line of p and magnetic field of p on the equator that is downward is in opposite direction of the magnetic moment of p so magnetic moment of q that is upward magnetic field of b that is downward so the angle between those two that is pi so we can say this position q5 that is also most unstable clear now q is placed at position q6 its magnetic moment that is in the direction of the magnetic field of p magnetic field of p that is along the axis that is in the direction of magnetic moment of p so here the magnetic moment of q and magnetic field of p both are in the same direction so theta that is zero so we can say this particular position that is also most stable position clear to all of you